New information on that recent fatal crash on I-70 that claimed the lives of three people and its possible underlying causes. Two News reporter Deborah Bogart has the follow-up from the Ohio State Highway Patrol. A lieutenant with the Dayton Post says ongoing construction is causing many issues on I-70 as they have had several multi-vehicle crashes in the last several weeks, including that triple fatality crash last week. We're having problems on that area because there's, there's um, construction going on in the state of Indiana, but when it backs up because of their intermittent lane work, it's backing up into Ohio. This map shows how road work near eastern Indianapolis is causing traffic to back up to the Ohio state line. Lieutenant Jeffrey Freeman of OSP says ODOT has set up advanced signs by rest stops warning of construction ahead and have put out message boards alerting drivers to any crashes or delays, but says there has still been a rash of crashes involving westbound vehicles. Vehicles are slowing down and obviously the speeds are in, uh, higher in that area than they are around metropolitan areas and then when people are stopping either people aren't paying attention or they're driving too fast to get stopped in time. He says the best way to prevent a crash is avoid any distractions and pay attention to what's going on in front of you as well as to your side. Do you see flashing lights ahead as far as do you see uh, hazard lights flashing that's in, other drivers indicating that there's something ahead. According to Indiana Department of Transportation, lane closures are happening both directions seven days a week and are expected to last through November. Deborah Bogart, 5 on 2.